Hello friends, this is Pankaj and you're watching AEM tutorial. So this video is the part 3 of responsive grid in AEM. In this video we will see how you can activate layout mode. So to configure the layout of a responsive grid, you need to use layout mode. And using this layout mode, you can resize the components using the blue dots. So let's see how you can activate layout mode. Go to the AEM instance. Now open the CXD console. Now in this CXD console, go to the content folder. Now open this uh, Geometrics Media page. Go to the EN, this English page. Now go to this JCR content and copy this CQ colon responsive node. Now go to your page VTrain. Go to the JCR content. Now paste that CQ colon responsive node here and save this. In this CQ responsive node, we have breakpoints. This is for phone. You can see the properties here. And this is for the tablet. Save it. Now go to the sites. And here open the English page of our website. Click on edit. So this is our responsive grid and this is the mode. Here you can see we have activated layouting mode successfully. Now add the CSS for breakpoints. So go to the CXD console and go to a client folder. So in, in the EDC, go to the designs, go to the project training. In this training page, we have our client library folder. In this client library site, we have this CSS folder. So in we have a git.less file. So let me double click it. So here you can see. So AEM uses this less file that is linear style sheets. This is the CSS extension file. To generate parts of the necessary CSS, these need to be included inside the project. Now go back to the page and uh, go to the design mode and activate the general group and activate the general group this is already activated click on ok now go to the edit mode and drag and drop some component here let me put the text component so this is the text component let me write some text here yeah. So this is the text, click on OK. Now go to the layout mode. So in this layout mode, click this component. Here you can see these two dots. Using these two dots, you can resize your component. Suppose this is how you can resize your component and uh, you can see how this looks like in different mobile or tablet devices. So go to the iPhone 5. So this is how it's looking like in iPhone 5. Again, you can see this text in different devices. So this is iPhone 6 and this is the iPad. So you can use this layout mode and adjust or resize based on your need. So this is all about the responsive grid in AEM and how you can use it. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe my channel, like this video and share this with your friends. Thanks again for watching.